within the long section here on expectations this is another subsection that is known as moment generating functions here is the definition of a moment generating function let x be a random variable again could be discrete might be continuous the moment generating function of x is and you can see that the moment generating function is defined as an expected value and this notation here is pretty universal m of t is equal to the expected value of e to the t times x provided the expected value exists on some interval negative h is less than t is less than h for some positive real number h this expected value has to exist in some neighborhood about zero now there are three things that moment generating functions are good for the first thing is moment generating functions are good at generating moments that should come as no real big surprise based on the name but there are two other things that are very important that moment generating functions can do first of all they are very good at finding the distributions of sums of independent random variables and we will get to more of that in chapter seven and finally the last thing they are good at finding the limiting distribution of a random variable that will be a topic for later namely chapter eight so at least for right now we're just going to look at moment generating functions for generating moments